Well, the Yankees have signed a pitcher to a contract who it's really hard to know what's happened to him because this guy, since the end of 2021, is basically a ghost. There is nothing about him on the internet. And this is Riley Gilliam. Now, the Yankees have signed Gilliam to a minor league contract, and he last pitched in 2021, then had Tommy John surgery, and there is really nothing about him since. Now, Gilliam was drafted in the fifth round of the 2018 draft by the Mets. He's a 5'10", 27-year-old right-handed relief pitcher now, and as I said, he had Tommy John surgery at the end of 2021 after he was horrendous, th- um, throwing 27 in a third innings with a 9.88 ERA at double A in the minors for the Mets. So really bad. He had injuries and he had Tommy John surgery. But since then, there has been nothing about this guy online. He's not pitched for the last two years. Missed all of 2022, all of 2023, and who knows what the Yankees are really getting here. When he was a prospect for the Mets, he was never highly ranked, but the report on him was that he threw a fastball in the mid-90s with an upper 70s curveball, both of the pitches had good shape on them, and that he just profiled as a good reliever. You know, solid fastball, solid curveball command issues, but got a lot of strikeouts. Who knows if the Yankees are going to get that kind of pitcher? Because back in 2018, he was one of the best relievers in college baseball. So maybe the Yankees think, hey, this guy just recovered from Tommy John, should be 100% healthy after not pitching for two seasons and having being two seasons removed from Tommy John. Who knows what the Yankees are getting here in Riley Gilliam, but the Yankees have decided to sign him to a minor league contract. Obviously, they see something in him, so we'll have to see what happens, but the Yankees have signed kind of an unknown reliever.